50. We're episode 50. Why are you cutting no! it? It's recording now. <laughs> Yo, oh my god. <laughs> this cannot be real. All right, hold on, hold on. the worst that we've ever had. I swear episode to God. 50, nigga. All right, episode so what up? It's episode 50.1.2.3. Welcome back, it's Lockheed Speaks, episode 50. Let's get it. Yo, Thanks, let me just say this real quick. Fuck episode 50. This, oh, hell no. This nigga, this nigga Demetrius then <laughs> fucked up episode 50 to the max. You said with two different cameras. <laughs> niggas On had top to, of that. Niggas four takes. <laughs> three audio clips. Niggas forgot the lights. <laughs> episode 50. What up? It's your boy, Freddy Duco. I'm here with Cutie God. No. I'm here with whoa, Will whoa, it's cute guy, and we're here, here, Freddie Duke. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. You see the Welcome back, guys. This is a bit... Hold on, you <laughs> fuck me up, nigga. Hold on. <laughs> he, yo, this nigga wouldn't be in the video so bad. He might as well have been in it. I swear. That's why he fucking lit up for us. He's like, yo, if I'm not in it, you're not having a good episode 50. With the famous Will Harper. What is up? What up, what up, what up? And what is up, guys? Your boy Freddie Duke. I'm back with another fucking podcast. And it is episode 50. 50 man. Yo, Big we banger. got Cutie Guy. 50 no, don't turn down my mic. We got Cutie Guy. And we got Freddie Duco. We got Will Harper. We got Cutie Guy. To the got famous. And behind the behind scenes. The back behind. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, put the yeah, yeah. Was doing that shit was hard. That shit was hard. The edit was wavy as fuck. Go like and subscribe to that last video. You know what I'm saying? Yes. That's episode 49. Back here with some new, sh- <laughs> some new Swift shit. First, First off, I want to say this right now though because somebody's gonna say it. Didn't Logfee have that on in one of the videos? That's mine. That was new Swift. New Swift. New Swift. That's what that is. Yeah. That's why I said new Swift. Surprise. Gotcha. Yeah, I bought one for him. You should go stain that one red. That'd be fire as fuck. Red? Yeah, just put like, go get some berries, make it home. No, no, I'm literally talking about like homemade dye. Camera. You gotta focus. Bro, this is about to be the worst episode yet. It's supposed to be special. Episode 50, right? Like, watch it. When you be watching, you can hear our voice. You're gonna be looking at the ceiling. Like, what the fuck? So today's episode was. <laughs> Oh my <laughs> Just get to the next one. Get the- and my, oh, fucking, nah. my fucking you- vape died. That's a sad Yo, thing. Yo, Quentin, would you let a girl tattoo her name on you after sex? Yes. Yes, sir. Say it again. Yes, I'll let you tat any what? initials. <laughs> I said I'll let you tat any initials you want of you know my name. Yeah, right. so, yes, my girl, yeah, definitely. Yo. Right after I clap them cheeks, hell yeah. How about you, Will? Hell yeah. As long as the current shawty. <laughs> why, would you, why would you do that? He said, I don't know. I, I, All right, again, all right, let me specify. Right, Are we talking go. about relationship or a side bitch? Uh, side bitch is no. Both. 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 If it was my wife, my girl, titled, uh, sure, why yeah. not, right? Uh, initials. I wouldn't want my name on nobody. Um, but if it was a side bitch, you're getting a backhand from hell. Mm. Thanks. My side bitch can get it. It's got to be know. labeled. Nah, though. like, that no. means you just was that one. You was no. that nigga. Yeah, it does. But, like, just guess this. Check this real quick. No, you check this. Right. Imagine this. You don't even like this bitch. She had her, your name tag on her. Like, your full, your full name, right? hmm And your boy happened to just see this bitch. She had a sleeve with a big-ass Quentin Bourgeois on it, right? Big-ass. And they're like, oh, Quentin, bitch, ugly as hell. Taking pictures and shit. Like, yo. Your bitch hideous, bro. And you can't say that's not your bitch. She's she walking around with your it's whole. Not my bitch. With your whole, your whole I didn't tell it. I, I, Don't matter. She decided to get her name tag. That's her decision. Don't matter. Her opinion. Don't you want to get that on you? Go ahead. Go ahead, mama. Go ahead. Do your little thing for me. Honestly, then now, no. Now, other bitch not gonna fuck with you because they are gonna see your name on another bitch. How would they see that? What the they, hell? If they see her. Wait. So just because <laughs> she got your, your name, she got tatted. my name tatted on her, they gonna think like some shit. Yes. Why? Because your name is tatted on another Facts. bitch. That's not. But it's not that, my bitch. It doesn't you matter. Fucked. So what? So it's different you're in the wrong. That's now when she now nah nah. Listen, put it like this. But nah. First of all. But nah, so <laughs> put it like this. Put it like this. If another bitch is gonna get my name tied on her that's not mine, listen, I don't care what you do after. You can show whoever you want. You can put it online. You can say, Oh, look, I got Quentin name tied on me. No. Go not ahead. Me. Because no. at the end of the day, I know I didn't tell you to do that shit, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I know I was I don't like, want I know I was like, go ahead, girl, get bro, that name tied on. No, bro, I didn't. imagine all bitches that you fucked got your name tied on. All? All of them that you fucked. 
That mean you that's just, weird. That's just like you starting a brand. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next question. <laughs> you starting a brand. <laughs> next question. Think about that. You starting a brand. Right. You know what I'm saying? You got girls lined up. Like, look, got I know plantation her. Plantation for Lamar. Yeah, for real. But, but not so. That's hot uh, as well, fuck, yo. I would, I would love to get a girl's my name tattooed on a girl's butt. Quentin, you're right. You just see that shit jiggling back and forth. Your name is but your name wasn't tatted. Like in a little wig. Like, <laughs> yeah. Not a shit wavy as hell. Why you look like that? Because I'm hot, bro. This shit is burning. Like, I can bro, feel the rays. It's hot because it's hot you have some. <laughs> Let me get some more. It's my kind of candy in this motherfucker. Because Will's puffing on that cotton candy. That's cotton candy? It's watermelon. Oh. Sound dumb. <laughs> yeah, um, this is episode 50 and we're fucking back yo shout out to uh gatorade for making this powerful drink uh shit is slapped you should have said shout out to the cute god for making that powerful drink boy that shit is a good shout out to hennessy hey, hey, get it together e and j apple boy we already put that out first there, off cut that we don't need niggas know what's in that cup so mm. um, right. that's the special drink for the bitches that we'll it's a special cop. drink for for me man, if you hey, nah but Love you behind the camera. Today we're gonna to be talking about. You got Tourette's. <laughs> like, right? Today we're gonna to be talking about Tourette's. Now nah, Will has Tourette's. I don't care. Will has Tourette's. Tourette's. He got Tourette's. Like you got Tourette's. Nigga, I don't know where to be saying some random shit. Like I'm not saying. Random shit. The camera's looking at Eddie. Not, Green, so I said Eddie Grant. Fuck. We don't know <laughs> that Eddie Grant, <laughs> nigga. Look at this. The, the oh. audience is gonna know, bro. The audience is gonna. It's like no sense. The audience is gonna know. But that's not. I said Eddie Grant, like with a C, because nah, get out of here. Because it don't like. No. Like Eddie Cran. Yo, what is happening? <laughs> the only thing that I'd be yelling out of nowhere, I want ice cream. <laughs> like, <laughs> you be saying random ass shit. Like, I need sprinkles. <laughs> Honestly, we're, we're, gonna start, yeah. we're gonna start making. You're behind the camera. We're gonna start making compilations. We gotta start making compilations, like of like funny ass parts of the episode. Like when I'll be like, but not so. Yo, I'm really about to punch you in the neck. I but see you over so there zooming me. in for no reason, yo. <laughs> I'm reporting. I'm, re- I'm reporting. But Naso is coming podcast. soon. <laughs> New God, I'm clothes. having everybody go report that. You see how you just ruined? I'm I'm in the middle of an interview and you over here talking. You see how you just oh, ruined it? I'm the host and I can't even. I can't, can't even think. Can't, I swear to God. Because he won't shut think. up. Yo. <laughs> Stay behind the camera. Bro, relax yourself, all right? <laughs> yo, you <laughs> won't stop. Relax <laughs> he's still going. Yo, yo, when you was behind the camera, he wasn't talking this much. At all. Like this. <laughs> but he can't help it because he's locked to the feet. Love. <laughs> Just go get a tripod and set up if you want to be in the, in the video. The yeah, right. He's going to be in the video at the end. We're already eight minutes We're in. We're already eight minutes in. Of nothing. We haven't talked about anything. But Naso is coming soon. Probably in the Where? next two weeks. Clothing okay. line. Clothing brand. Me and him. Log feet starting that shit. Where? You already know what it's about. Which I was gonna <laughs> speak <fucked> about. <laughs> CT Sports. What's that about, Fred? Talk about it. I don't know if I should talk about it, right? Because okay, don't I would love to talk about it. Hey, you waiting like, for you? Nah, talk about it. I just that's what I was waiting for. I was waiting for him to say something. Like yeah, I'm gonna talk about it, right? Oh, I was gonna see the shirt. Move the, move the strap. Move the strap. Move the strap. I mean, strap. Fred got the strap, huh? But I got the glizzy. Yeah, you wanna see the back too, right? Oh. Mm-hmm. What you talking? About? Um, what do you want to know? What it's about? What What's hell? it about? CT Sports or NFSCT? NFCT. NFSCT. NFS get it right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. right. You right. All right. I get it right. Need for Speed, Connecticut. Mm. Uh, basically, it is a Instagram page that I made to get ready to promote the car web series that we're about to start. But also post like live content from like locals, right? right, right. Um, because Connecticut doesn't have shit to offer like to anybody. So a lot of shit to offer. Don't play with CT. Nah, not for musicians and not for like just yeah, like local facts. shit like that. Um, we got like taxes to offer and houses and retirement op- funds and we shit also like got that. Will Harper facts. All right. He said facts. Um, <laughs> but he's doing crazy shit. Um, right now. Niggas just striking the shit out of me. This nigga relax. <laughs> Cameramen. Cameramen don't just do that. Yes, they do, nigga. The fuck? Get it inside the eardrums and shit. <laughs> like, give me a physical examination. What the fuck is wrong with you? Nigga, stop Nigga, stop playing with me on the camera, yo. Bro, I was playing with you. You see how you zooming in for what? Listen. <laughs> Host, you are the cameraman. <laughs> stop talking. Stop. 
Yo. <laughs> Ten minutes in. This is, <laughs> <the> <laughs> most, this is the most calm. Complicated. Yes. yes. There you go. I was about to say conversational. <laughs> the cameraman's ever been. <laughs> He's not a paid intern either. <laughs> He's the main host of the fucking show. Anywho. Now, next time I record it, I'm doing the same shit. Nigga, I'm going to be fine. Yeah. Once I start so screaming crazy? shit. Eddie Grant. <laughs> Madonna. Madonna. But no, the, fans so. will know, the fans will know. <laughs> the fuck? What you said, nigga? Are you, so, so, at the end of the day, are you going to be... Yeah, yo, he said Eddie Grant. <laughs> I zoomed in on Eddie Grant. Eddie the, fan, Grant. the fans will know. Yo, That's what you I, said. Yo, this is episode fucking 50, and we're out here acting nuts. Anyways. <laughs> oh, oh, no. No, no. No. Like, comment, subscribe. You tell me? He's going to start recording the wall, yo. All right. What are we, what are we talking about? <laughs> are you going to start selling You gonna start selling clothes, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm about to start selling clothes. Um, this nigga is eyeball, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, like I hate this nigga, yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to look over. Wrong. I look over like over this wrong. nigga just like staring at me. <laughs> yo, you might as well have been on this episode, nigga. You might as well have, nigga. Yo. <laughs> and you never say that. The nigga just got this shit focused on you. <laughs> Stop, yo. I can't breathe, nigga. I'm hot. I'm sweating. <laughs> You're like a chicken, nigga. <laughs> You got the rest for real, for real. Yo, you need help, bro. Who look like a chicken? He said me. He tried to say this for a shit. But you was waiting last time. Yeah, look, I was watching. Yeah, what was what you guys saying, bro? You guys are real quiet. Nah, because you being crazy, bro. I got I got a clothing line. What's your clothing line, bro? The right, show sure. the world. That shit's coming out. I actually, it's coming in tomorrow. Yes, sir. So what you guys want? Well, you guys want hoodies? No, yeah. They all shit then I got late. You tell me about that. I, yeah, I told yes, you last did. time. You just not listening. You guys don't pay attention. No, he anymore. never. I swear to God. I wasn't He's been speaking, speaking about it. Yeah. He's been speaking about it. I didn't know until like last week. But he's been speaking about his clothing brand. Mm. Yeah. All comes in tomorrow. You can look at my <coughs> bio. That shit. You say you want a hoodie. What's your I'm about Instagram? to hook you guys all up. I'm about to get you everything. What's your Instagram, bro? It's official. It's, why are you filming him when I'm plugging my shit? Because he's, he's not a cameraman. He's not. Hey, man. My Instagram. My Instagram is official Will Harper. Yo, we got to stop asking the cameraman a question. You got to just yeah, interview. Let me be, nigga. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gaining up on me and shit. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's tired. Yo. He even focus on the next question. I want to ask you, buddy. I swear. I'm just laughing. I think this is hilarious. <laughs> I swear, he like he will zoom in, and he's like, "Why the fuck are you doing this?" Stick it up. They test me. It's gonna be really good. Yeah, no, this, this really no, good. no, fuck all this shit. This nigga. This nigga came and speaks. Why are they all gay? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you mad? Why are you mad? <laughs> Stay behind the camera. Stay behind the camera. <laughs> Hey, you don't even have the mic either. You just behind it talking. He's just battling. It's not gonna be in the fucking footage anyway. <laughs> yo, he, they gonna be sitting here watching this like, yo, why they to keep stopping? Like, why is it? Like, who the fuck is that talking in the back? Like, it's yeah, long. Up, the By what? The mic. It's not picking shit up. I'm watching it. Here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he he got direct. You had to yell for the shit to pick you up. <laughs> he said, <"Durp." laughs> Anywho. So you got a clothing brand. That's you got true. a clothing brand. Yeah. But now it's was on the way. You got a clothing brand. We all got clothing. That's what's up. We sitting here trying to be our own. See, now let me ask you a question, though. Go ahead, go ahead. If you hold, like, if you start a clothing brand, you should be able to dress, right? Mm -hmm. How can you start a <laughs> 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 Why you start laughing? <laughs> because you know where this is going. How are you going to start a clothing brand and don't like to dress? Mm. So I'll let you speak on his behalf since he's not here. Yeah. <laughs> he is here. <laughs> No, we not let him speak though. Listen, if you if you can't dress and you start a clothing brand, you it should help you learn how to dress. Is that what you about to say? Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. it should help you learn how to dress, but it also help you learn how to just be a business businessman type shit. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather him walk around in suits all day. <laughs> <laughs> Who's him? Why you pointing? He's him. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna speak on it on camera, but all right. So yeah, nah, walk around in suits all day, but you're not. Gonna That's how you zoomed in on me? You're not gonna make any business <laughs> off that. <laughs> Why you, you keep smoking? Right you you keep, how you gonna keep smoking and trying to get the smoke out, nigga? You it's, you smoke it. It's that simple. It's, it's hot, bro. It's hot. It's the lights. Nigga. We finally put the lights on before. Anyways, nah. But 
being a business, being a, being your own business person, is is is, is really wavy. Honestly, I want to start being, I want to start doing a Bonasso, and more so than just Bonasso sweaters, hoodies, shirts, hats, socks, Shop. pussy tattoos, all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Now, um, do you have the audience to sell out all the shit that you're gonna buy? True. Oh yeah, we do. We definitely do. So you think you sell all the merchandise that you buy in the first month? Not in the first. I'll say in like <clears> two <throat> months, I'll sell out almost everything. I'm a good. I feel like in the first. This is a question for both of us. Show, show him. All right, so for the merchandise, I feel like we're definitely going to do some giveaways. Because <laughs> you're the last person to talk. Um, we're definitely going to do some giveaways. Uh, we're going to give people going to buy some, and then um, we're definitely going to do some free gifts for anybody, any guests we catch. Jeez, I just peeped that ICS chain you got on, literally. Yeah, big facts. All right. Back to you, cue the guy. You should sharpen that up. Free giveaways. Like, 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 I'm broke. No, I'm talking about you should carve it. Right, right, log fee. Demetrius. Log, log, log to, to the, the fee. fee. <laughs> <laughs> Made into a math equation. That's what that's the type of shirt you should sell. Yeah. Log to the fee. No, nah, we're definitely going to be selling log to the fee and cue the gods eventually. <clears throat> nah, but um, starting our own brand is easy, I think. I mean, starting your own business is easy too. Selling out is easy for us. You think so? <clears throat> you think so? You got your own clothing brand too. You do. It's different though because I had to watch the stats before I decided to come out with like the the clothing. Yeah. Why? Because I'm not gonna sell shit that nobody's gonna buy. It's not Garrett. Yeah. You got, but you have fans already. You too. No, no, no. This, has not, this isn't from Freddie Dugo. This is from CT Sports. Yeah. So I had to wait in order to see. How many people is fucking with it? Like just the page in general. Then drop like those the fake preview of the clothing to see who would actually want some. And then I got like a good feedback like, hey, let me know when they drop, and I cop a whole bunch. So then I was like, all right, I can start investing into it to where I can sell it and be confident that I would sell out before I even release them. So numbers, numbers. As of right now, like you too. Well, think about your numbers. How many like how many people do I expect to want them? Or you gotta talk to me. You gotta be specific. expect like how many you expect to sell, nigga? What the hell? Like I'm expecting to sell all, all my shit. I'm not expecting so, that. I'm I not expect, expecting half ass shit. I'm expecting to get all my shit out. I expect to sell out all my shit within the first two weeks. Um, oh. because I'm not dropping a lot. I'm dropping probably fifty total. Mm, okay, so you already have Smart. the number in your head. Right. What you will. I put a <coughs> poll out on Instagram actually with like a outline of my merch. Smart, smart, smart. And I was like, who would actually like who would I got I put a poll <laughs> I put a poll out on Instagram and said like <coughs> who, who actually like wants to, to buy this and I got like five hundred people saying they wanna buy it. So I put like I only got like thirty five hoodies. Um I bought forty shirts and shit like that, all sizes. So um I'm I'm expecting to sell that out in like a like the first week. And then I'm just about to keep buying. Damn, nigga. Shit like that. The first week. Yeah, he's yeah. Like, you said two Jeez. weeks, though. That both, weeks. Of y'all, <laughs> both of y'all said two weeks. I was like, damn, y'all really, y'all really sell me on shit. I'm I, no, I said two weeks being, like, generous because 50 is not a lot. He has a lot more merchandise. That's what I'm saying. Right. A week for him, that's crazy. But 50, 50 items, together. they have 50 items total. So that's why I'm like, that's going to go fast just because it's not a lot. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, I'm going to have, like, a final. He show. said he got 500 people that want shit. Which yeah. means you gotta double that. Yeah. So that means you gotta buy a thousand items. Something like that. Yeah. In order just to have stock left over. Left over, right, 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 right. Because I didn't ask how many people is gonna buy them. I wanted to know who was fucking with it. Yeah. Um it's a different between you know, yeah. he, he knows who's fucking with it, you know? He's like, I got five hundred people. Right, he got five hundred guaranteed motherfuckers that said said there's gonna buy yeah, it. Yeah, I mean as people saying it's not always guaranteed. Right. Some that's people true, just you know true. say supportive. <laughs> But, but you gotta be smart with like the pricing and shit like that. Like, mm-hmm. <clears throat> if you make the prices OD, nobody's gonna actually like buy them. But you also can't be like cheap with it. No, <coughs> right, right, you know right. What I'm saying because you gotta make all the like I mean, the profit back and shit. You you can't base your prices <coughs> off of anything until you find out how much you're spending on That's getting true. it made. Yeah. Um. Luckily, in my situation, I'm gonna be making close to double. Ooh, I shouldn't be saying that though. Yeah, we don't even. We didn't ask you, even ask you about that. We just asked you. I mean, thinking. Yeah, no, nah. So it's still, but that's the thing. It's mad cheap. It's affordable. Um, I just know how much it costs to make the, the like to get shirts and get them uh, printed. So 
a bunch of business owners over here, literally young young men trying to work, get a business going. But but not so. It's coming soon. I promise. I don't want to give y'all no hints or nothing. I'd rather just surprise y'all with, like, you know, when I come on the web. That's stupid. No, it's not. That's real stupid. It's not. How are you going to surprise somebody? You got to. Right, see this shirt? You see this the reason shirt? Why I say, see this shirt? <clears throat> the reason why I say not to surprise is because you want to make sure you have people ready to buy. No, oh, yeah. no. I'm definitely going to have people ready to buy. We we are going to have people ready to buy. Yeah, but the people that you tell about it, I'm saying, like, listen, obviously. If you want to have more than the people that you know, you got to start promoting it. Duh. Y'all got you mean, duh, you just said it's a surprise. <laughs> no, I said I'm going to surprise y'all when I have mine. I didn't say I wasn't going to. If you're dropping promo, then I'm going to find out regardless. No, I'll follow not. you. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to be having one. You're going to have one, most likely. Yeah, I've been on the podcast for like probably like 12% of them. I was about to say like 20 episodes you've been on. I don't like think 20. Uh, no, I probably was only on like seven. But we're at episode 50. Episode man. 50. It's fucking wild. <clears throat> and the, the thing about this is like Demetrius doesn't even allow bitches on the podcast no more. Don't care. Yeah. We uh, we allow we allow. Uh, wait, wait, yeah, we don't. We I'll allow women. All right. Yeah, yeah we, sex, we don't allow, allow bitches. <laughs> we allow women. Yeah. When was the last time we had a female on the podcast? I I know when. You nigga. I know when. Yeah, you was the you was the last female. Yeah, on fuck here. out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, right? Niggas after they have jokes. <laughs> he's like, you got hit. Remember the episode? He's like, you got you got a good jokes on. Huh? Yeah. Good one, huh? That's he's a like, real good one. He's like, he's like, what's that more? It's, 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 it's like dick and balls. Yeah, it was a good one. That's why, I don't, that's why I stopped coming on the podcast. <laughs> this nigga's the worst cameraman in the world. This nigga just, but he's never the cameraman. You're normally no, the cameraman. No, he's the cameraman. I'm not normally nothing. <laughs> <laughs> he had me do it one time to test the, the paid new intern. camera. Uh, no, nah, that was he one time. T- yeah, nah. Barely. He ate half the fucking dried mangoes before I got them. Ah, him. you have some to live. That's true. I had like three. With people a mango? I had like three. <laughs> what? We paid people a mango? <laughs> <laughs> we paid people a dry mango? No, that's the, say. By the fact, he said, by he, the fact he, that he I think about it. Mango, he said I got all the mangoes before he got here. I was like, what? Nigga? Nah, I got this nigga a 4 for 4 too, so. <laughs> you see how cheap I am? Nigga got me a $2 bag of mangoes. <laughs> Why are we even talking about that? He got me a $2 bag of mangoes <laughs> and a 4 for 4 You spent $6 on me. $6 to come. <laughs> that bag of mangoes was like $5. All right, so watch your mouth. You gave half of them to Will. You're behind the camera. <laughs> Shut up. Anything else you guys say? We did 23 minutes in this shit. Nigga trying to rush out of here. Nah, honestly. We haven't get to no good shit yet. We haven't. All we talked about was tattooing on, on Will and I mean, this nigga. Fuck are you staring at me for? Switch the, switch the camera. Yeah, this nigga stationary ass camera should have set up a tripod. You should have. Could have, would have. You ain't do no sweeps. Not at all. I don't know, staring at the sandline. You'll see, you'll see, niggas. Eddie Grant. So what y'all think about relationships? Well, how long did it take you to say I love you to someone? <laughs> Woo! Are we going there? Yep, because that shit was funny as hell. <laughs> <laughs> I said three days after. I'm playing. No, nah, I believe you. No, nah, nah, tell me why. Tell you. me why. I just got put in like a weird situation, bro. Nah, I don't want no lies coming from you. Bro, I know you're she, a lover boy. You're a no, cancer. You're a cancer. So I know that you meant it. So explain to me how that happened. I'm not judging you I mean, because no, no, I, no, I know she, how quick. Like yeah, feel me? So my girl says she loves me. And I'm not about to say I don't love you back if I, you know what I'm saying? So you're saying you have to, you, you don't have to mean it? In order to say you love you, because you did said, you mean it when you said it? Not you don't got it. You ain't had to put her, but specifically yeah, in your past, have you you know said it without meaning it? Yeah. No, nah, but the question was, how fast did you say I love right, you? Though. And fact, I wouldn't expect it to be a lie. I want to know that how fast that you said it and meant it. Right. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't know if I like. I don't know if I meant it. It was just like a. She was like, oh. No, so like, then I fuck that you. story. Mm-hmm. How, what was the? Oh my, like actual. Yeah, the actual time. To, yeah, how um, fast did it take? To like to mean it. Yeah. How long does it like take? a month after like we started dating? So it is no okay okay. Cause like I, I don't know I wasn't like sure if I actually loved it like you know what I'm saying like we started dating and then like I actually started to like okay you know what I'm saying like I'll say it and I'll actually mean it you know what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Like I couldn't even spell like L U V when I text because I didn't be like you know what I'm saying. L U V. That's the non meaning <laughs> version. I said like L U V. Like, I, I love you. You know what I'm saying? Like, that type of mm-hmm. shit. But so you didn't mean it. Then yeah, it. that's what I'm saying. You didn't even spell the whole word. You didn't even spell I it didn't right. I didn't mean it until, like, properly. a month after we started dating. Copy. Copy. Um, 
The fastest for me had to be like three weeks. After you saw dating? That's that's decent. Um it was weird how everything happened with me and her though. Um we were talking for two weeks. I I met her I right, so let me break it down. I met her through like a friend. Mm-hmm. Um then I was like, all right, we can go on a date, whatever. Um but in between that time, it was two weeks before we went on a date. So we was t- texting and shit like that. Um, then we went on a date. Um, so, yeah. So then we went on a date on, come week two. And that day was fire. Like, right, right, right. The best, like, not my, it's not my best date, but like, uh, that's top three. Mm-hmm. So, um, and then like that final one week, she had like came over, because we had already we had fucked obviously because on that date, so we was already like fuck. Wait, you said obviously? I didn't know that. You didn't see that before. <laughs> I was no, I'm saying, like, but yeah, no, nah, we we got. Oh, fuck, What's up? It's Lord, he speaks. Episode fifty. Let's get it right. Let's get it tight. He said he didn't have Tourette's. <laughs> He was in the middle of a story. <clears throat> but what was I saying? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you said you went on a fire day. Fire day. We were supposed to oh, know yeah, that you so, had yeah, fucked. Nah, yeah. We fucked that night. We got you. Um, <laughs> can I finish? <laughs> can he finish his story? Uh, damn. I think he fucked up. Fucking. Up. Supposedly. Right. So, yeah. We fucked that night. It was cool. Then she, like, we chilled for like a week, straight fucking. And then it came to where like you could feel somebody's energy. Like we was, but this was in the middle of sex. And a lot of people say that there wasn't that you can't it's not real during sex, but mm-hmm. I felt it. So like I could tell that this bitch wanted to say that she loved me. Like I felt it in my body. So right? I was like giving her deep strokes. I'm like, should I ask her if she loved me or should I say it? Right. So Yeah, I heard this story. <laughs> Like I said, I was like, should I should I ask her or should I say it? I was like, fuck that, I ain't saying it first. So I was like, you love me? And she's like, she's like screaming at it. I fucking love you, dude. So I was like, all right. I was right. My intuition was right. So then I said it back, obviously. All right, right. And then after sex is when like she like really questioned me, like, you really love me, dude? So I was like, yeah. And then after that was, but you meant it though. I, nah, I meant it. Let's see, but was after <laughs> that was a one time thing. It's complicated, it was, bro. You'd be lying, but. <laughs> After after that, I don't think I never said that quick again. Not three weeks. Three weeks. Uh, not me neither. I don't think. I don't think. I'm a think cute I, guy. Honestly, it took me like two. No, I say three weeks. A good three weeks. Maybe almost a month. Cause like it was my first love. Like I ain't never had no girlfriend. Like you know her chill all the time. She like that, and then. Now, matter of fact, what happened was, some, it's crazy because I'm surprised I even did say I love you because kind of find out, like, I guess she did something with her friend that wasn't like, you know, I wouldn't say it was cheating, but it was cheating enough in my eyes. So then, like, still my first love, I gave her a second chance type shit. You know, I'll, anyways, I gave her a second chance and, and end up telling her, I was like, oh, it's cool, whatever, and we chilled one day. And we didn't, I think it was after sex that I ended up pointing to the fact that, I mean, saying that I love you and shit like that. Well, but she was a virgin. I was a virgin. I was a virgin for a long time. No cap. I was. What are you sucking your teeth for? What the hell? I was a virgin until I was like almost a j- sophomore, junior year. Sheesh. Yeah, nigga. I was, That's what, some weak shit. Wait, wait, when did you use a virgin? What the fuck? When did I lose it? Then when did you lose when it? When I was 13. What the hell is wrong that with was, you? I was fourteen. when I lost my virgin. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you, you was raped. Got... I don't want to hear that. <laughs> <laughs> not fucking raped. <laughs> the fuck? No, you was raped, and then you, I don't know what happened with you. You, uh, But y'all niggas was, for real, for y'all niggas was. What? Uh, when did you lose yours? 18. Oh, okay. He's like, he's like Kevin, but See, that's why. I, I, I lost mine at like 16, 17. Like, I was a decent age. It's not, all right, so my thing about that is, we got if you, if you lose your virginity later on in life, and it's not that I want people to rush into like losing their virginity, mm-hmm. but you lack a, like this big chunk of maturity for like a while yeah. that you gotta make up for. 
Cause like you don't even know what sex is like you like the niggas that don't have sex until mm-hmm. a certain age still like playing with fucking toys, toys and shit. And shit. And right, right, right. They don't go to parties as much as the other people, and they don't drink and they don't do none of that shit. They literally they still come home when the streetlights come on. So I was about? coming, I was coming home when the streetlights came on. Right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, who are you talking about, nigga? <laughs> what? what are you talking about? I'm just talking about people who, like that who, in who, general. You talking about in, in general? general. I must have, I must have just quoted your fucking heart. Bro, bro, because he's like, who's over? Who's over? I want to know. Like, that he's taking it personal. Niggas still playing with toys? No. Nah, nigga, well, when I mean like toys, I'm talking about like video games yeah, and shit like shit that. Like that. And um, still watching wrestling and shit like that. Because like y'all, those niggas are those weirdos. That's why they didn't get no pussy. It's not because they was ugly. You're just a weirdo. You just didn't know how, that you could get pussy, nor did you were scared to fuck pussy. So you you saying you was fourteen, you didn't have no love, no love life or nothing like that. Like you just fucked some chick when you was fourteen, yeah. lost your virginity. Yeah, and you think that's a good way to go about it? No, but I think it was. You too will. What the I fuck? Think I think that, it was thirteen. I think like that blown it, was it got. I got rid of that awkward stage to where I didn't have to find someone to fuck in high school and then not know what I was doing. Well, I got I got lucky enough to where I got to high school. I always I was already experienced and ready to start breaking walls. Uh, See. But I wasn't even like looking back on it now. Wasn't even experienced like that because I didn't get like truly like demon sex mode until I started demon. fucking that bitch that I told you I loved in three mm-hmm. weeks. So I mean, it is what it is. And Will, you was. 13. That's yeah, but she was she was 16, so I mean she like kind of knew what she was doing. Okay. That that's what that's how I almost lost my virginity. Yeah, I know. That's why I said you was raped. <laughs> that's how I almost lost. Nah, my, my my brother snitched on me for that one. Oh yeah, I, I remember you talking about that shit. No. And I, but now that I'm kind of glad too, but though because she was a little hoe. Looking back on that, I see. Um, the best way to lose your virginity is to the one you fucking love and the one you want to keep fucking all the time, and that's exactly that's what that's happens. not realistic though. It is realistic. No, it no, happened no, to me. No, it happened now, to you. That's that's a real. I, I literally that's put a real my nigga in there. And I case. never. I didn't leave for like three years, that, four years. That's a small case though. You're not. Not everybody's gonna find a virgin, right? That's why, a, why you're a virgin. No, no cap. All right, I told this one chick. I, I told did. one chick. I told this one chick. That I was dating. Yeah, but in this room, listen. Two that's no, 50%, right? no cap. Right, right. Fifty, fifty. Literally, go call your girl in here. And ask her. Well, like, like I said, anyways, that'll make. I it. told one chick. I told her. One, I told this one chick. I know it sounds shady as so hell. I told her I don't want to fuck until I find a virgin, like a chick. Somebody's a virgin is virgin. You know what I'm saying? I told her that to her face, and it happened. Literally, it's about the willpower you have in yourself. No, because no. you would have waited. Imagine you would have to wait until you was 24. Bro, I wasn't waiting until I was 24. Okay, I, then. So that's what I'm saying. It's, you wasn't guaranteed to get a fucking virgin. Virgin, right? But so you would wait until you was twenty four. That's what you just I, said. I'm Imagine not, having the willpower <laughs> to not have sex okay, until you find that but person. It's, it's strict willpower in the sense. That's, but that's not, I did. I thing, after I broke with her, I literally found somebody that was a virgin, and uh, we fucked for like for four years. And I respect that. Years. But what I'm saying is, because he's trying to make it seem like I'm not telling people to go lose their virginity to just some at fourteen some random ass person. No, I, listen. 13. If you want to fuck at 13, 14... <laughs> Don't I, take my advice, but I'm gonna say go do what you gotta do. Shit, like but, you, I, I don't, I don't get how that helps you though. Like when you're, you said that it makes you like, well, mature for the next, you know, it age. makes you feel like you're a lot mature sure, than what you are. At nah, at fourteen, nah, you're doing some, you're doing some grown shit. At sixteen, I feel like I was doing. Some but shit. all right, so let me well, not are say you this. Mature? Let me not say this. Let me I not say this. Are you I'm mature though? Let me, let me. That's the question. Does it? You said it makes you feel, but are you mature? Right. You're still only fourteen. Your brain's still thinking about. Wrestling and toys that you were talking about, right? But you're not doing that no more because what are you doing? You're trying to act older than what you are. I wasn't. You weren't. I was, I'm talking, I was I'm talking about regular, <laughs> regular people, right? That lost their virginity, except for Will. Where that, I don't wait, even understand. That. I just want to say one thing, one thing only. We got a minute and two seconds left on this recording. I really time. want to have a get into this conversation. We should have started with this. We, one. Sh- yeah, I know, we bro. Should, but we, we really should have, but. Now All we right. have 54 well, seconks. Oh, fuck it. It's, it's dead it because we have 50 seconds. Well, this was episode 50. Cute we'll bring it back. Welcome back. We'll bring it back. This was a fun one. We're going we're gonna to bring it. episode 50.5.1, whatever you want to say. Right, fuck yeah, it. 50. Call it what you want. This shit was lit. 44 seconds left. You know, cute to God. You got hosting. Freddie Duco. Freddie Duco in the building. Big Will in the building. William Harper. You know what I'm saying? Merch dropping tomorrow. So any ladies, any men, hop on that shit. I'm not dropping it. He's not dropping it tomorrow, dingus. Shit. But we dropping but not so real soon. Please go like and subscribe to these videos, all the previous videos that we had. You know how we come in. Big chicken.